Today, we are going to discuss about Qurban and Aqiqah in Madhab al-Shafi'i. Now, what is Aqiqah? Now, Aqiqah is the ritual of sacrificing one or two portions of a specific animal to celebrate the occasion of a child's birth. What is Qurban? Qurban is the ritual sacrifice of a specific animal on Eid al-Adha and the days of Tashriq, which falls on the 10th, 11th, 12th, or 13th of Dhul Hijjah of the Luna Hijri calendar. When can I start doing my Qurban? You should start, or you can start doing it as soon as you have finished your Eid prayers. What are the different kinds of animals I can do Qurban on? Sacrifices of Qurban or Aqiqah can be done on three different kinds of animals. Number one, you can do on camels. Number two, you can do on a cow or a buffalo. Number three, you can do on sheep or goat. How many portion of sacrifice does one animal equal to? One goat or sheep, it is equal to one portion of sacrifice. One buffalo, one camel, or one cow is equal to seven portions of sacrifice. Can I do aqiqah on a cow? Yes, you may do aqiqah on a cow. And for one cow, a cow is sufficient for seven portions. How much must I donate from my qurban? For every single portion of qurban, it is compulsory for you to donate at least one portion that is able to feed a poor man for at least one full meal which consists entirely of that meat. However, the best is to donate one-third of the meat to the poor and needy. You take another one-third for yourself and your families and distribute another one-third of that meat to your neighbors, relatives, and friends. Is it obligatory upon me to do Qurban or Aqiqah? The answer is, it is not compulsory or not obligatory in Madhab al-Shafi'i for you to do the Qurban or Aqiqah. However, it is highly encouraged and recommended for everyone to do the Qurban and Aqiqah at least once in his lifetime. It is also sunnah kifayah to have at least one of the family in one house to carry out the qurban. So be sure to have at least one person to do qurban in one house every year. Ya Rabb, ya Rabb al Abdul Fagiru Kalalbab